In these tough economic times, neighborhood bookshops are becoming an endangered species, but not everywhere. Iowa Writers Workshop alum Ann Patchett is an award-winning author who recently took a risk and did something completely unexpected. Look at her impressive bio, and right there below the list of best-selling titles and awards, you'll see her latest achievement, Book Seller. A lot of people think that bricks and mortar bookstores are dead, that books are dead, but Oprah and I and all of you know that that's fiction, because here we are, and we're doing great. When our two bookstores in Nashville closed, I got together with Karen Hayes and we decided to open Parnassus because we knew that we didn't want to live in a city that didn't have a bookstore. All of the shelves that you see in the store actually came out of different border stores that were going out of business. When I was growing up, I went to Mills Bookstore in Hillsborough Village in Nashville. It was a couple of blocks away from my school. Everybody knew us. They knew what we had just read, and so they could always say, oh, you know, you just, you've been reading Little House on the Prairie, now you've got to read Charlotte's Web. People who would put the right books in our hands. These are some very good books, and that's the kind of bookstore that I wanted to have. They're incredible to read together. Okay, thank you. My pleasure. Have you met Sparky? Sparky the store dog. <laughs> when there isn't a bookstore in your city, there's an incredible void because what you realize is that the bookstore isn't just the place you come to buy books. It's a community center. It's the place where you bring your kids for story hour. Oh no, what color is she? It's the place where terrific authors like Luis Alberto Urea come and give readings and people can just come and hang out. You can pick up a book, you can sit in a chair, you can just be here. This is a wonderful store and it has a great feeling about it and that's the feeling of being surrounded by books. Books give us empathy. Books allow us to go into someone else's life and step inside their skin and see the world through their eyes. And that's what makes us more compassionate people. <laughs> Reading for me has always been the greatest comfort in my life. And as long as I had a book, any book, I'm not alone. I can't imagine a world without reading, without books, and I can't imagine a world without bookstores.